Hey you guys, it is Monday the 21st, I think, or is it 22nd? No, I think it's the 22nd. Girl, I'm back to drinking coffee, especially after this morning. Go have a seat, go have a seat. Go have a seat right now. No, you're good, go have a seat. Here, now go have a seat. Child. I ain't gonna talk about you. He, he I am. I am. I ain't gonna say everything, but JB decided to throw a little fit at the grocery store. I can't count on my fingers how many times my child has thrown a fit, and I don't care what anybody says. Every child is different. The look, I know how some people, some people like, I give my child a look and my child stops. Not with JB. Mm. The look just makes JB cry even harder. What I do with my child is I ignore and correct. Ignore and correct. That, if he starts. I, I do not like when one you ignore me. It exactly. makes me cry and have Egg. a fit and slap me in the face. <laughs> no, I don't slap you in the face. Well, ignore. I slap myself in the face. Even better. So yes, I ignore him. You know what he said? He said he doesn't like it when I ignore him, but it works. I ignore his little ass and then I tear up those legs when we get home. Don't play. So anyway, you guys, I'm having coffee. I'm back to having coffee. And I'm back to having vanilla milk. Yeah, anyway, we are looking at old Vlogmas videos. Actually, I only did Vlogmas once and it was a lot of work. A lot of work. <laughs> um, we may do it this year. JB said he wants to do it. Um, because like I stated, um, maybe I feel like I'm always repeating myself, but not everyone watched everything. So I'm a sweetheart. Uh, hair related videos will slow down. Come, I'm trying my best to push out. I have to record almost every week if I'm going to do this to push out videos by July 1st <laughs> and then just do vlogs and chit chats. She checked I will still be doing my hair. Um, so we have been home for a few hours. I met up with my friend Robin, and it was so great to meet her. She invited one of her friends. Y'all, normally I don't like that, yeah. but I've had to get used to that because, and we were I don't know, I, we were chit-chatting. A lot of my friends, a lot and of my friends, a lot of my friends talk to me talk about me to their other friends and then that friend wants to meet me like a lot of a lot of my friends you guys are mutual friends like i tell you i was still your friend so introduce me to your friends i was still your friend my best friend i stole from another friend we had a great lunch and miss robin offered to edit my book for me which is awesome you guys so i have all my stuff here i'm going to pull up my laptop here and make some edits again and I'm gonna give myself a deadline of two to three weeks yeah, to send her my book. I don't think you liked it, but you were at least were able to try it. Yeah, I think I may cook some Ethiopian food here, so it just takes so long. Like, prepping can take all dang on day. And my husband's family taught me how to make it, so. I can cook it better. I'm a I'm a clock my own tea because the family taught me how to make it and I've been cooking it for 10 years, you know? So, um I'm making a cocktail. I'm drinking this cocktail I'm making right now, girl. When you grow, when you grow up, you when I grow up, I better, I'm already grown up. So, I'm, I need to be a chef now? Yeah, you need to be a chef. Ooh, <laughs> oh, Lord have mercy. Speaking of I need to, it's not really on my goals, but I did I, I did buy a recipe book, blank recipe to capture, uh, document my recipes. So that's something I am going to be doing. Do I have those? I got I. Don't do that. All right, y'all, I'm just rambling at this point. Child, I'm at the dollar store. They got bikini top. What type of dress up kinky shit is this? Look at, the, can, can this fit over my? Look at these stickers. So pretty. Mm. I already have these. Look y'all, I'm at, is this thing moving? The car? My car is on, it's our 
already hot. It's already 90 something degrees. I'm at the dollar store. Let me show y'all what I bought. You know what? The dollar store is a trap. It is a trap. They trapping you when you go in there. They trapping you with some of stuff you don't need. Uh, I don't forgot what I was supposed to go in there for. But I ain't got everything but I was supposed to, what I was supposed to get. I did get some snacks. See, this is part of the trap. And I yelled at the checkout lady. At first, she forgot my snacks. I said, uh, excuse me. She said, oh, girl, let me get your snacks. I know you're going to eat that in the car. I said, you, you know me? You've been reading my diary? That's exactly what I'm going to do. Mm, this will be real good with that vodka. It'll be really good. It's frozen, though. Um, Y'all, I'm, I'm sorry. Um, is this really moving? 94 degrees outside. All right, see this is what I'm talking about. And yeah, if you see my Dollar Tree video, you saw that we got three hours of snacks. And sh First of all, we have one, how do you have, I'm talking loud, how do you have one hour of food and three full hours of snacks? And then I got some sugar. You guys, I try not to buy, this is funny, but I really try not to buy sugar. And so this is the first time I bought sugar since the holidays. Yeah, cause we, I don't use a lot of sugar. I prefer to use agar syrup or honey. Um, I think it's cute. Pineapple tray for ice, excuse me, I'm spitting for ice. Or um, the checkout lady, she's like, oh, you could put um, chocolate in it with coconut. I said, you, I like the way you think. <clears throat> I have some travel bodies, travel bodies, travel bottles for my husband. I already got my stuff together. This is cute. They had a bunch of LA color stuff. I try not to go crazy, but they had this LA colors loose face and body shimmer shine like a star. I want to shine like a star for the summertime, even though I won't be summer ready. This is like yellow. Okay, I think that'll be really cute on me. Um. Hold on, y'all. After this, I need to take my fluffy butt home. Let me put this stuff up. Ain't no damn club. I'm sorry, y'all. Let me get it together. I got some foil paper. You don't want to see that. I got some morning starters. Uh, some books for JB. He's struggling with addition and subtraction. And then morning starters first. Great. So I saw this liquid eyeshadow, LA Colors. Isn't this cute? It's like a lavender color and it's metallic. This is so pretty. I have so much makeup. Real pretty colors. Pout play. Isn't that cute? All right, y'all. It's gonna be hot this summer. April, 94 degrees. Another person has died out here. Hold on. At the Grand Canyon. And I know that it, a lot of the times, well, of course it's, it's tourists, a lot of the times it's people who are not even from this country. Let me tell you something. I was surprised as hell myself. Anyone coming? I was surprised that there ain't no railing. There ain't, there ain't no, you know, they got signs that says, you know, be careful, slippery rock. They mean that. A woman fell to her death. Sorry, y'all. A woman fell to her death a couple of days ago. Some people fall to their death taking pictures. When we went there a couple of years ago, my ass stayed. My husband started going out there too far. It is very dangerous. I remember a couple of years ago, a whole family like fell off and like half of them drowned. Gross. We're not, we don't have a lot planned this weekend. We are going to be visiting a new church. I need to figure out which one. Um, on Saturday, y'all, last time we were at um, church, and JB's such a sweetheart. This age is so sweet. So even though he gets on my nerves sometimes with all the whining and not listening to me, I have to appreciate him now at this age because while we were at church, he was, first of all, he said he wanted to sit with me, which I really didn't like. So he's like, you know, I'm six now, so I can sit with you. I said, we're not leaving early, so I don't want to hear it, okay? So a church service is not that long. I mean, with worship and the sermon, it's only 45 minutes. That's really not that long. So, but he, so he kept moving around, moving around. There was a lady next to us, and I wanted to make sure he wasn't bothering her, but she was just smiling at him. So as we were walking out of the church, she came up to me. She's like, he is so beautiful. I'm like, oh, thank 
cute. She said he wanted to, I told her he wanted to sit with me because he said now he's six, but I'm sorry if he kept moving. She's like, no, that's the age. She's like, you know, enjoy him while he's his age because she pointed to her child. She said, he's 12, so you got six more years. I said, oh, Lord. So, all right, y'all, I am rambling. The next time you see me, I'll probably kind of come on on um, Sunday. My husband's off. JB will probably want to get in our pool. Y'all, our pool is ready. My floaties are not ready, but um, I usually get in that pool with a bunch of floaties. The, the pool is only five feet, but since I'm paranoid about being in water station, what's the point, girl? I don't know how to swim, and since I still have this fear of swimming, I, float, I um, blow up like, I kid you not, I have about eight or ten floaties. Ain't it no matter. Jamie looks at me. When I blow up all those floaties and put them in the pool that goes up to my chest, he's like, Mama, just get in the pool. How <laughs> many floaties? I have the ones you lay on. I have, a, you know, whales, you know, sharks, boobs. I have a huge hamburger. Girl, all the time, because I need to catch just in case. I need to be able to grab on something. <laughs> Uh, buttons type thing so I picked it out and I bought this from the Dollar Tree and I'm just gonna create me a little bomb case this is some pair of earrings I got from Walmart a while back that I've only worn twice and I don't like them because they you hear that they make too much noise so I'm gonna pull some of these off and super glue them on here and I'll show y'all what it looks like when I'm done Isn't this cute once it completely dries I'm gonna get some of this stuff off the side so yeah I took a um Three pieces pieces of jewelry plus what Miss Lori gave me to make a cute little phone case. This cost me one dollar because buttercream this is a yeah you see that it's done this is a styler excuse JB I would have to use with a gel or use on wet her damp hair I don't think I I added moisture but not enough clearly because it's yeah it's frizzing out let me show you what I'm wearing just simple um, this belt could be a little bit tighter to pull in this waist but see how it could be yeah it's come through waist um yeah i'm happy as hell all right but we don't want that type of attention so we make it a little bit looser this is my purse remember boo show them what you're wearing jamie's like whatever so i can show you all my makeup while he's coming just simple jamie's just simple no bow tie today because it's too hot for that child our bathroom the contractor is officially done y'all when I tell you the amount of professionalism look this young man and he's young I and mean, he's probably in his late 20s early 30s he was able to do all of this him and another guy in four and a half days the glass guy came today and took measurements and yes this is what everything looks like now it's still drying in some areas but I love it this is what the pebble looks up looks close up um and i shared a picture of this sort of kind of when it was still in the process and a couple of you guys were like yeah it has a spa feel that is exactly what i was going for a spa natural like feel i have my epicent salts and bubble baths and stuff that's going to go over here with some candles and ready to go um yeah i'm excited yeah i'm re really excited so the glass guy's going to come on wednesday and to install the um the glass because it has to be custom and um yeah that is it so i don't feel so because at first 
when I said earlier, maybe I didn't, that I was a little concerned about all the different textures and everything and if it will clash with the floor, floor and all that, I'll be okay. This is beautiful, I'll be okay. Now we showed him our guest, guest bathroom and uh, my husband just decided out of the blue, let's just go ahead and, and knock that out. I'm like, well, go ahead then, Alex. So, <laughs> Good morning, good morning, good morning, you guys. It's Friday, it's Friday, and I'm ready to swing, pick up my girls and do the damn thing tonight. Girl, we ain't doing nothing tonight. Um, I have tried to record this video now. This will be the seventh time um, I was at home trying to record it. But my child wouldn't let me be great. And I had to pause for the calls. And um, yeah, handle handle him, girl. Handle him. But y'all, it is Friday. I have a lot of errands to run today. I need to go get my nails did. I may get gel nails because I'm in a hairy. And I know Tina and Tom are gonna nickel and dime me. Wanna know, you know, you wanna you wanna Easter bunny on your No, I don't want no Easter is over. I don't want an Easter bunny. Yeah, I know I'm silly. I'm out here in front of JB School if you hear any kids barking. And <laughs> but I want to talk to y'all something real quick. <clears throat> about something real quick. I need to drink some water. My vo voice has been... <clears throat> Hold on, girl. Do I have some water? How have y'all allergies been here in the States? Because my allergies are up and down. I'm on Flonase. So yeah, y'all, this week has been so crazy for us. I'm excited about the bathroom, the, de the developments of our bathroom. Um, they will be finishing up next week. I'm really excited about that. This morning, I will be going to Walmart because I want to purchase two gray towels to go along with the white towels that I purchased. Because again, I want to give like a spa feel, a very clean, crisp feel. And I feel like with all of the textures going on um, with the bathroom, I need to be as neutral as possible when it comes to um the towels the rugs etc you see what i'm saying but y'all i'm having to dirty delete a comment this morning y'all and i think about that you know when i see a comment um i i'm a type of person i can agree to disagree and i have count i can count on one hand how many times i've had to delete a comment either someone's cursing me out or there's a comment why absolutely do not agree with and i'm like you just came right out of left field like that girl <laughs> the girl the young lady who left me this paragraph i mean of how i came off angry when i was detangling my hair either i was detangling my hair or i was using the pre-pool and i'm like girl you would come off angry too if you had all this hair today <laughs> but no she was really left field it was really like i'm like and, she, and it was a lot she had a lot to say and I didn't see it. Y'all didn't see it. So anyway, a person this morning <clears throat> left me a comment. And again, I couldn't see it. So anyway, this young lady, let's get to the point. This young lady left a comment on my, on a vlog. And it was the vlog where I spoke on <laughs> Marion. Y'all know who Marion Hampton is. She has the long hair, fair skinned young woman, beautiful long hair. She's one of those YouTubers, in my opinion, that you really have to take with a grain of salt. I don't think she has any ill intentions. I really don't. I don't think she... I don't think she comes off, I don't think she tries to come off as being gimmicky, and I definitely am not a person to want to put down another YouTuber. I'm not like that. I hope you guys realize that I, I'm sincere when I say that. But again, some of her videos, I'm like, oh, girl, Marion, what are you thinking, baby? It's on a vlog where I was speaking on the product that Marion claimed to be a natural hair relaxer, which it ain't no natural hair relaxer. It's really a butter. Now, I've had some comments from people who have purchased the product, and they basically gave their... Um, their thoughts on the product and i actually pinned one of them you know she left a very long comment on how the product was beneficial to her i'm like cool thank you for the feedback matter of fact i'm gonna go ahead and pin your comment okay let me get to the point let me read the comment if you're going to make a video offering help to others you should clean up your language everyone is not on your level of speaking any kind of way first dig Children could also be looking at this. Respect your audience, even, even if you don't respect yourself. Second dig. So I'm like, oh my God, what did I say? You know, I read the comment two times, maybe three times. So I looked at my video and I'm like, did I, was I cursing a lot? So I looked at the video, y'all. And again, it's a vlog. Not that long of a vlog from almost a year and a half ago. And I wasn't seeing it. Like, she's telling me to clean, my, clean up my language. 
I'm not seeing it. So initially I responded in a very PC way based off my 20 years of customer service. Like, you know, I'm gonna go ahead and delete it because I know someone's gonna respond to her, whether you agree or disagree with her. And I don't want that type of atmosphere on my channel. But anyway, y'all, that is it. We are not focused on negativity in 2019. Look, baby, I want y'all to do this, especially this year and going forward. And I, for a while there earlier this year, I was really focusing on some negative stuff. I was thinking about some things. It is real easy to get sucked in into that pattern of reliving some things and wishing you could have should have done things differently I'm all about reflecting on some decisions you made some behavior but then reflecting and correcting it so that we can grow right so uh, again if something comes up any negativity any negative energy negative people girl bounce that back bounce that off excuse me yeah bounce it bounce it don't bounce it back to them because you don't want that karma bounce it off keep it pushing think about it reflect about it maybe i should have you know changed the way i responded to that person look and they got they got bikinis over there for five dollars top and bottom let me see what i can get me so i can look sexy rexy how does that look on my skin tone y'all look i gotta blow up my floaties first now that's too that's pretty but i'm feeling this green this is a large but you know what it doesn't have any support and i want my girls up high this is pretty though isn't it Ooh, the back fat though i don't know y'all i'm on the clearance section now y'all they got everything over here from baby food to binders a bunch of toys That's cute for like college click kids. Hmm. There ain't nothing I see that I need. Did I just hit the jackpot? I don't need green though. I need brown. I need brown, y'all. Can y'all see green? Hey, man, you know what? God knew that I was coming in here. That, not for 450 though. What do y'all think? Here are the towels. See, these towels are $2.97. What the? Why are those towels so expensive? You know what? I'm getting these. I actually need some smaller than this. Yeah, see, now this is a step above. These are pretty. I ain't got time. I ain't got time for the kids. I ain't got time for it. Do you hear them? Uh -uh. I want something like this, tassels, but I don't want that color. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe I'll have it at Ross. I'm not going to Ross today. Let me see. No, see, no. Nope, that's not going to work. No. Y'all, what in the same hell is going to... I'm out of Walmart. But why when I went to go pay my uh, groceries, it said tender. Ten, I get an error, tender, car decline. I'm like, the devil is lost. So I did it a second second time using my debit card, my bank card, card is declined. I'm like, what in the hell is going on? So then I did it a third time, but I used credit approved. And it made me nervous. It made me nervous because there was someone behind me. I did self-checkout because they have the long long lines like you actual cashier at walmart they're really long self checkouts not the not the mini ones i mean you got a long belt you know to place your groceries on and there was someone behind me so i started getting nervous but i know i have money in my account I'm like, what the hell is going on so i did the guy went off he meaning he walked away he went to another because <laughs> he's like you ain't got no damn money <laughs> so i did it the third time using credit and it went through but you know what ever since these cards have a debit card i need to go ahead excuse me ever since these debit and bank cards have a chip i get i get issues so i swiped it so when i swiped it using credit it went through that doesn't need to happen to me um ever again because we're gonna be out this weekend i don't need to be embarrassed i mean i have my credit cards on me that i can use just in case or oh, I could just get cash out, which I try not to get carry cash on me. Has that ever happened to you guys where your chip doesn't work but the swiping does? I'm going to go ahead and call Make of America and be like, you may need to send me another card with the same number. Don't switch up my stuff because I need to use my card this weekend. That's scary. Card decline. Girl, it said tender. I'm like, tender what? <laughs> I guess it's a type of error. That has never happened. That's a lie. It happened to me because 
at Walmart, at this Walmart, but there was something wrong with the actual card reader and it wouldn't read the chip. So she told me to do swipe, but I didn't get that error. It just wouldn't take it. Really weird. I don't like that. But anyway, y'all, let's go ahead and go home, put up these groceries. I need to do some work, work out, and then we are gonna be running errands. This is already nine o'clock. So y'all, look, when I was getting my nails done, Tina did my nails this time. Five minutes into her doing my nails, a woman comes back in who was just there. I saw her pay and you know, she come back. And she's like, um, I don't know what's wrong with my nails, but there's spots on them. She's like, look, see, there's spots. So she's showing them to Tina. And then she kind of puts her hands over to me to look, and I'm like, girl, I'm not, I'm not looking at your nails. And so she goes on to explain. She's like, I don't know why there's spots on them. And Miss Tina tried to tell her what well, is gel and the polish is gel. So they go back and forth, back and forth. So she's basically gonna redo her nails. So uh, Tom starts to fix her nails and he puts a painting over it. He puts a, some more polish over it. And she's like, I don't want gel. And she's like, well, you have gel. Tina's trying to explain to her, you need to come back in three more weeks and I'll fix it because you have a gel set. And she's like, but I told you I didn't want gel. I'm like, girl, um, how do you go out the shop paying for gel nails? Cause there's a big difference. Those of you who don't know who don't get your nails done. Gel nails, first of all, gel nails die, I mean, they dry fast. So you would have known once your nails dry in like three seconds that you had gel nails. I don't understand, like you paid for gel nails. You really think that them gel nails are more expensive. So, child, they went back and forth, back and forth. She was upset. Tina finally snapped. She said, it's not my fault. I was like, well, damn. I'm like, don't get Miss Tina upset while she has a drill in her damn hands, lady. Type of nails. It could be the polish because gels, you see how smooth my, my nails, the nail art itself, gels give, gel nails give you an overall polished finish as opposed to regular acrylic, whatever. Anyway, girl, you. So y'all, I'm about to go pick up JB. All right, y'all, and I will, let me show y'all what I bought. Wow. Because I was um, having an attitude problem, I needed to spend some money and buy something for myself. So Revolution has this cute makeup palette and um, marvelous matte. When I tell you this makeup palette is fire, I'm gonna use this tomorrow. I'm going to do a yellow pinkish look. Look at that. I'm gonna be using this entire top row for my makeup look, yes. Look at the heaven, look at this, heaven on a plate, Cajun chicken pasta. Oh no, let's get that parsley out the way. There she go. Divine, so good, so, so good. Yeah, I'm gonna eat all this because I'm greedy.